as things happen. You're dirty, Thor. Tonight is my third time. Yeah, aren't I lucky? <laughs> what did Chewie just say to me then? He said, why is it so cold? After over 40 years, Star Wars The Rise of Skywalker means this saga has finally come to an end. And what a way to do it. Personally, uh, it, it's selfishly it's sad because I'm not going to be doing this with them again. And, and as a fan, you know, to see something come to an end, I mean, something like this, it, it, it's a, you know, it's an emotional thing. But I, I, I hope that people come to the film and, and love it and leave feeling better than when they got there. We're at the end of the saga. Yeah. Are you uh, totes emotion, as they say in Essex? Well, um, I was emotional on the set a bit on my last day. Uh, because there's such a loving crew around and JJ says some nice stuff. So that was a bit tough, stiff up a lip time. This is the last one, right? So like I'm trying to I'm trying to drink it all in now because it ain't gonna happen again. I just got a really nice text from my friend and my sister wrote a little card before I left the hotel. I, I've been friends with the same people and I always had an amazing family. So I think that's also what's kept all of this feeling not normal, but like, you know, relative because I go home and I'm just me. And then we come to things like this and we get to have loads of fun and watch a film. This is more of an ensemble feel in this movie. Yeah. So we, we laugh through the entire experience of this. Doing certain scenes, yes, very emotional. Overall, the, making this film was was uh, great fun. I had no idea it was going to be so emotional and that you would be so invested in, in the story. You know, I watched it since I was 20 years old. Who would have believed I'd be standing at the premiere of The Rise of Skywalker, having been in several Star Wars movies? Um, yeah, it's amazing how life works out, isn't it? Stop in the school at home, <laughs> No! <laughs>